Hey there, collectives, and welcome to your daily collective message today. Shout out to you beautiful, amazing people. Don't come for my eyelashes because they may be jacked. I'm just saying I'm, I'm aware of this, but practice makes perfect. <laughs> I know it's not about my lashes, but FYI, okay? <laughs> so we are outside. You hear them talking. They well, Welcome them over here. Welcome them in. See how beautiful and plush and serene and peaceful it is? Check it out, collective. You got a beautiful message today. Some of you guys may be going through the court system. Justice is going to be served. It's like what was wrong is going to be made right. It's already taking place spiritually because you have Archangel Raguel. It says justice, harmony, solutions. There are solutions in your favor. Your ancestors are doing your bidding. They're representing you behind the scenes, but you're representing yourself from within because of the seeds that you have sown. See, could be a Libra, somebody could be dealing in the justice system here. Archangel, Raphael, let's read it. Let's see what it's telling you. I hope this video finds you guys doing amazing. Thank you for returning to this channel. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if this video resonates with you, if it helps you in any kind of spiritual way, because that's what it's about. We're meeting each other because we are kindred souls. We're connected. We're all set in place to support each other in one way or the other. So it says this card upright heralds good news. Ragiel is the angel of justice and harmony. He brings fairness and compassion to difficult situations and relationships with others. A personal or work conflict will be clearing up soon. You hear that? Be patient. Perhaps someone has been annoying or agitating to you. Even hurtful or hostile situations will be on the mend. Some difficulties may have been an undercurrent of your life for a long time, creating a deep sense of injustice in you. If so, now is the time to change things. Speak your truth and make reasonable and honoring requests. Your soul longs for you to heal your relationships with yourself and others, and Ragiel is here to help. Whether it's your spouse, your boss, a co-worker, or a friend, this card collective is telling you that you do have the power to heal the energy of that relationship. Ragiel blesses your intentions to live in true harmony. See, now your affirmation is, I deserve harmony in my life. I call on Ragiel to help me bring greater peace to all my relationships. And that's what time we on. We on justice. So let's see. Now it says, you have the power to dictate the direction of your situation by your words, your thoughts. You're the manifester. Now you can speak uh, agitation on a, spit, on, a, on a relationship, whatever it is, or you can speak peace. I feel like this is one of those things where it's saying, um, Whatever it's like as above, so below. Whatever you bind in heaven is bound on earth. Maybe it's time for someone to take their authority and decree and declare. It's your words that activate it. Holy Spirit, activate. You better get them, Lord, before I get them, Lord. It's time for somebody to activate something. So whatever you deem is unfair and unjust, then the universe deems it as well. But maybe you're the one that has to activate it because you have the power comes from within. So let's see, Spirit, what is today's message for the collective in just this harmony solution? What is the solution? Thank you for our ancestors, those who protect and guide and minister to us with synchronicities and signs and wonders. Are you paying attention? Something is working out. Ooh, you got a king of wands here. Wow, King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, followed by the Ten of Pentacles. So there is some type of delay or stagnation happening here. The hangman, somebody is full of regret. Someone thinks that they done lost out. But I don't feel like that's the case at all. Four swords, there is a need to pull back. It could be money related. You could be feeling like somebody has did something behind the scenes. Someone's not able to move forward. Someone feel like something, see, but you will though, see, but you will though, see, but that's the thing though, you will though, see. I feel like your stressless, stressful, restless nights are gonna be a thing of the past, see. See, somebody finna get they 
Somebody finna get their stunnerism back, god dang, because you already know that King of Wands. See, wow. Somebody could have taken a fall. Somebody could have been jealous of someone too. Somebody may have wanted to see you fall or somebody wanted to stop your money. Somebody may have stopped your money and you feel like you're not able to move on, see? But you will. So someone may be owed some severance pay or some money from a job. You've been in a long time. You're going to gain victory. You're going to get it. Somebody may be trying to walk away from a situation, but they want to make sure that they're all right. You will be. So let's clarify these for you. You have the Ten of Pentacles, which represents, it could be a family. It could be a family. Somebody could come from a big family with money, prestige, and power, and they're using it to control someone. You may have to go to court about it. You're going to gain victory. It's going to bring, you're going to reach a healthy solution in your favor. Somebody's not happy with the verdict or somebody's not going to be happy with the verdict. Oh, don't rain me out. Let's hurry up. Clarify. What's up with this four swords in the reverse? Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Someone has stopped something or someone has hindered something. See, but you're going to get it back, though. Ace of Wands. You're going to get your passion back with somebody ego. Maybe someone is being stopped because it's something that you need to learn because maybe somebody's been very, very selfish here. I'm getting a Leo energy for somebody, Capricorn. Somebody may be stopped and blocked because it's something that you need to learn. Or maybe somebody was, somebody could have been a real, real arrogant. You know what I'm saying? Somebody could have been a boss. Somebody could have had a lot, but somebody's learning some lessons here. See, somebody very, very cocky. Very, very cocky. So that's why they're taking a loss. I feel like this is a lesson. Somebody want to hear him get out here and stunt and strunt, but somebody been blocked for a minute. Why is the five of cups here in the reverse? Somebody, you know how some, you know how what they say to whom much is given, much is required. Someone may have had a lot going on, but they still was, a, you know, still did not handle it right. See, page of ones in reverse. Somebody is very, very immature. Somebody may have been gambling a lot of money away or. See, this is somebody's cycle. Like I said, somebody's in their le learning cycle. So, see, and it's just like everything is that they go to lover's card, but it could be a relationship. Could be somebody here that was very, very selfish and very, very arrogant, very prideful. And as a result, they're going to have to learn some lessons here. So it could also represent it just as what, what is right is right. And somebody may be receiving karma. And that's just your that's just your karma. That's your justice. You can represent that too because you got the will of fortune in the reverse i'm just getting that somebody may have thought that they was all there and they just doing people any kind of way but they were finna get it all back now somebody's in their karma stage and they can't do nothing about it because they got to learn some lessons why and see they upset they unhappy but once upon a time they were very very selfish the only thing they were it's like all they looking for is the, the next best thing but they're selfish greedy kind of egotistical they've been shut down See, they're unhappy. Somebody's unhappy. And the reason why they're unhappy, because once again, they got an answer for this karma. Somebody thought that they was getting away with a certain type of lifestyle just for them have to, just because somebody is, see, somebody slowed down now, see? And I feel like somebody has to pay for something from their past and they cannot escape it, see? Somebody's getting back their past karma. Could be about everything. It's affecting them. You could have been in a relationship where your person thought that they was all there because they had money, they had power. They could have been mishandling their power. So as a result, somebody's karma is knocking on their door. I feel like somebody's woke up and their whole life is going to change. Why is the five of pentacles here? Somebody trying to manifest it, though. And although the power's in our hands, spirit says it's still not going to work. And the reason why it's not going to work, because this is somebody's karma. Could be a Scorpio, could be a magician. See, 
Somebody's trying to somebody's trying to avoid karma because they feel like it's not going to ever get. And when I say avoid karma, something that they have sown the seeds. OK, their wrongdoing is caught up with them. So you could be in a situation where someone was doing you wrong and they probably thought that they would never have to come to court or deal with this. They're dealing with it. It's starting. It's going to get it's going to get them at what they hold the close to them, and that's their money. Especially if they were mishandling money, stealing money, withholding money. If they if they took money from you, justice is balancing the scale, it's gonna come back on them. If someone was using you in a relationship, it's justice is coming back up on them. Somebody's in their karma season. King of Wands, and they're not able to move forward either. Why is the chariot in the reverse? Could be a Cancer, could be a Gemini, could be a fixed sign. This in reverse, Capricorn, Pisces. Share it in the reverse. See, there it is. See, Spirit know how to get you. Karma know how to get you. Hit them pockets. See, King of Pentacles in reverse. See, it's that same cocky King of Wands. <laughs> they still run around here trying to act like they have not. Somebody's still trying to put on the facade that they not being affected, but they are. But they need their ego. They, they, this is what they come to the dark shadow of the soul. See, they ain't that roaring lion like they used to be. For some of y'all, could be a Leo you were dealing with. See, there it is. There goes somebody's insecurities coming to the surface here. And for some of y'all, it's based on love, their relationships, uh, connections, partnerships that they have mishandled. And now it's coming back. Uh, the King of Wands could be in that energy, that, that prototype. Somebody was very, very cocky and haughty, see? King of Wands thought that they was all of that. They thought that they was a God's gift to somebody. You know how you're dealing with somebody here who boss, who paid and all? It, this could have been a marriage for some of y'all because they go to Queen of Pentacles, see? And that go judgment, see? Because we just seen the King of Pentacles in the reverse, see? Somebody got just oh, over this. Ooh. Wow. Ooh, see there, somebody under judgment of this relationship, see? Ten of Pentacles, could be a marriage you were in. Could be in a relationship where y'all were common law. Y'all necessarily got to be married because most people, you, they don't deal with traditional things. See, could have been about a relationship. There they go. They don't somebody losing out. Somebody could have called somebody to lose a house, a home. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Somebody may have once had it all and they may be losing it or you're going through some type of divorce with your person and they were a butthole trying to hide money and you have to go to court and I feel like you're going to see Ten of Pentacles. There it is. See? Justice. There it is again. See? And there it is. Six of Pentacles. See? See? There it is. See? Somebody probably wasn't taking care of the household or the relationship. Maybe somebody was out here acting like they were single and they wasn't. See? <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. See? I feel like you're going to end up being better off. Because that's in the upright. They're in the reverse. The hangman, see? I feel like this is a marriage. Somebody's going to leave better. Somebody's going to leave better off than what, what they were in this relationship. See the hangman? Death, endings, transformation. Somebody's about to get justice, but somebody's dealing with a lot of karma too, see? And it's about the relationship and all of the deceit, see? Somebody's nine of pentacles, see? That's what's going on. Somebody could have been dealing with a cheating spouse, a cheating boss, a deceptive boss, holding money, denying money, listening to their ego. But somebody, I feel like this is a marriage. Nine of pentacles. And I feel like just as y'all going through a divorce, see? And you're going to end up being good, see there? Ooh, they go to Empress, though. See, y'all could, this could have been a real relationship. I feel like this was an intense connection of marriage. Somebody ain't waiting on this no more. Somebody turning their back on this. And someone has the passion to move on. See, someone is no longer in denial. See, 
see, this could be a third party, or this is just someone taking back their passion back, or with this Archangel Raphael, Raguel is bringing in justice and the solutions that you need. And for some of y'all, your best solution is that you're going to be a very wealthy uh, divorcee, because I feel like this was a marriage that somebody here messed it up because of their ego and their pride. But once again, justice is about to be restored back to you if you sowed the right seeds. All right, Collective, this is your today's message. Please like, share, and subscribe.